Uh, Dave Johnston here with Dave Trade the Markets. Uh, we're looking at a two-minute chart of the um, March crude contract. Uh, today is Thursday, January the 19th, uh, 2017. Uh, the day has been um, uh, basically controlled by uh, sellers. Um, the uh, news was released um, uh, today, Thursday. It's usually released on Wednesday because we had a holiday on Monday. Uh, it sold off here, bounce, sold off, bounce, sold off. Um, I've got a buy stop in here to actually go long should the market hit 52.10. So, um, and that's right at the top of this magenta bar. So, just want to sort of um, set this up ahead of time uh, and uh, may or may not get filled, but I uh, just want to uh, sort of set the stage for this recording. And um, uh, I'll pause the uh, video right now and uh, pick it up uh, should we get filled. Just restarting the recording for a moment. I placed a sell limit in here, uh, 5225. Should we get filled long at the 5210 order? So it's the only adjustment I've made. So once again, I'll pause the recording. Okay, restarted the recording here. We just got filled a moment ago. It's already moving up quite nicely. So we're getting a good breakout on this. Uh, we are long four contracts from here. We're trying to sell two at 52. 25 we're long from 5210 so I'm going to go ahead and put any protective sell stop uh, just below this last dip this last dip that we had right here so uh, that is at a price of 5201 so I'll put it at uh, 5198 right there and a sell stop for four okay so just bring you up to date on that we did get a breakout and uh, it's had a nice uh, swift movement so hopefully we can reach that first objective here fairly soon so um, uh, once again I'll go ahead and pause recording okay just restart the recording again for a moment I put some markers in here uh, and also added a sell limit for one contract at 5240 so we've got um, got all our markers in here stops at 5198 we're long from 5210 our first objective is 5225 second objective is at 5240 so just uh, bring me up to date on that and once again I'll pause the recording just to try and keep this recording as short as possible okay start up the recording again uh, because we do have a nice green bar right here which is our second strongest aggressive uh, buying bar uh, and the low of that bar is at uh, 52.07. I'm going to increase the stop to 52.03. Uh, I'm sorry, 52.04, three ticks below the low of that green bar. Okay, we just got filled on our first objective, so I need to adjust the stop to break even and also down to just two contracts on that. We just have the two contracts left, so uh, we now have a break even stop. And I can. Uh, cross that off here um, so we're we're looking good here hopefully it can uh, continue to move higher uh, break even stop on two contracts and we've made 15 ticks on each of the first two contracts so uh, start out with four contracts on this trade so once again I will pause this recording try and keep it as short as possible okay just resume the recording it's kind of slow but it is continuing to move up we've had some support in this area in here as you can see uh, before it moved up again um, so we got some lows in here around about uh, uh, let's call it 17 so I'm going to raise the stop up here to uh, uh, 13 not that that's a big deal but uh, now that the market has moved 20 ticks in our favor I hate to just have a break even on that but could very well come down here and get us but uh, I think it was only prudent to go ahead and make that adjustment on that stop so I'm getting really close to it. It's maybe going to happen right now. So, okay, there it is. So, uh, just got filled on that at 13. So, just three ticks on the uh, second two contracts. So, that's six ticks on that. We had 30 ticks total on the first two. So, 36 ticks uh, profit on that particular trade. So, um, that's it for now. I uh, hope you got something out of this. Uh, uh, once again, this is. Uh, the day trade the market software and if you'd like to contact us you can do so at info at daytradethemarkets.com thanks for watching and we'll see you next time